Hey everyone, so I am going to be vlogging today. I'm going to be taking you guys around with me for the whole day, basically, and maybe even the rest of the week, but for sure the rest of the day. And so I'm going to do my makeup, I'm going to show you my outfit, I'm going to show you where I go eat, I'm just going to show you a bunch of stuff. So I thought it'd be nice to start doing like a day in the life video or like even like a weekly vlog situation because maybe you like to see that so um hopefully my hand's not shaking too much i'm holding this camera with my hand but, so yeah i'm going to go do my makeup and take you guys along with me today My hair is from Hair by He. It's like going on almost three years old. Uh, just a closure wig. Very, very chill, very simple. I am going to, oh, I'm gonna put my Cartier Juston Clue on. I love this bracelet. I love this bracelet. I am going to try to find some silver earrings to go with this bracelet today because I lost all my earrings this year. Like all my nice earrings have been lost. Those are Bear and Teddy on the bed. Uh, <laughs> just in case you're wondering, Teddy's looking at me like, who are you talking to? Like, that's Teddy. Teddy and Bear, right there. This is my everyday bag. I just, it's just easy. I love, that's why I like the jumble flap because on my frame, I'm five foot five and like 165, 170 pounds. I am kind of not like a tiny petite woman. So this bag is perfect for me for every day. And then I'm just gonna be wearing these Laurel Piana um, loafers, <laughs> even though I wish I would have gotten them in a darker color. These are like so perfect for every day. Um, and let's go. This is the bag. Pants, the shoes, and me. 
I know you want me Everything that's only when you're lonely yeah, yeah. You see you think you know me But you don't even know nothing about me yeah. You see my thick thighs Lost when you look into my brown eyes You see my lips always commit your switch sides You never know the devil in a disguise So why don't you stand up, baby? Yeah. Tell me, tell me, tell me Do you want me on top? So let me show you, show you, show you I don't need to back it up Got the goods. I'll show you guys what bagel I got in a minute. <laughs> I look a little disheveled because I didn't wear a bra today. <laughs> Let me just come. And you know, here where I live, masks are not mandatory. So I got the brisket bagel and it has onions and then I had them put like a very light layer of um, fermented Serrano cream cheese oh this guy is literally gonna have to walk by me whatever <laughs> whatever so I just want you guys to get into this it smells incredible. I love everything bagels, so I made sure to get an extra everything bagel so I can have, like, a couple of bagels for breakfast this weekend. So, like, one on Sunday, one on Saturday. It'll be good. But let's get into it. This is what it looks like. And they make these bagels fresh every single day. Mm. And they make the brisket. Oh my god. Mm. It's so good. And another thing that I really like is that with these everything bagels, I mean, they're literally the best. Getting some crispy bacon, a little bit of cheddar cheese, a little bit of like cream cheese. And some um, grilled chicken. Oh my god. It is such a nice lunch. Or brunch. Or whatever. Or like snack. Whatever. But this brisket is so good. I also like onions. So. Oh, onions are so good. Mm, so yummy. Mm. So another thing I did was I put my Just Don't Clue uh, have a ring on because I thought it just looked really cute on the same hand. I love wearing these two pieces together. Oh my god, it's so spicy and so yummy. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. It's been a really long time since I've had brisket. Like a really long time. So, if you ever come to Lexington, Kentucky, you should come downtown across the street from the courthouse and go to Pearl's. Oh my god, so good. There's so many cool places to eat in this town, I swear. And I still have like one more half left, but like this is so filling. So good. Mm -mm. <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> that bagel is better than being in a relationship like it's so so good I am taking these pants that I got from H&M like two years ago in a size 12 which is a size too big I mean, sometimes I wear size 12, sometimes I don't. I'm taking these long wool pants to the tailor, and then I'm taking these Anaquan shorts 
to the tailor. I got these this summer at Bergdorf's. And then I'm taking this Zimmerman um, dress to the dry cleaners and this Hermes scarf to the dry cleaner. So that's where I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go like dry cleaners, cut over, tailors, Best Buy. And then I might go to Wilmore. A lot of people don't think I'm from Kentucky, which I think is kind of funny. But like, I love living in a small town. I love living in small cities. I love living kind of in the middle of nowhere. It's just like, I just like the small town feel. So Lexington is not the smallest, but it's definitely small. So anyways, this dress has been in my guest room for like months because I've been needing to take it to the dry cleaners for a very long time and I forgot. So now that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna drop these two off at the dry cleaners, go to the tailor, might finish my bagel at some point, and yeah. So I'll see you guys in a second. Headed to Best Buy. Ugh. I'm not excited to see how many, how busy it is. So I just left Best Buy and I think it's safe like for me to tell you guys what I got because nobody other than my mom really watches my YouTube channel like in my family. So, so I got my son an Oculus. I was kind of apprehensive about this, but I actually think it's gonna be really nice. So I'm excited about this. Um, I think that like everybody in my house can play this and so it's gonna be really fun. And yeah, so I got one of those. I got the one with like the smallest amount of like storage because we, we don't need anything crazy. And then if you watched my kind of Christmas list, Christmas guide for him. Um, I got one of these. I am going to probably go back and get my mom one, um, but this is for my dad because I know he always like lets his coffee gets cold. And so I think this is a really nice thing because you can kind of keep your coffee warm all day long um, and like adjust it through an app on your phone. Then I got my brother a blender. This is what he specifically asked for. Just a KitchenAid. Nothing crazy. Ah. So, that is what I got at Best Buy. So cute. Oh. I'm vlogging. Oh. <laughs> you wanna be hey, in it? You look cute. Hi. <laughs> Thank you. I am. And this is Alicia, my favorite person. <laughs> oh, I love this foundation. So May, do you have a favorite product in the store? I do. What's your favorite product? Okay, I love my favorite product is the Augustine Spiders. I love that one too. Cream. It's so good. <laughs> this is so nice. I like the body cream too. Oh yes, it's so it's really good. And there's a set, holiday set now. With oh yeah, cream. right here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh yeah, this is a really nice one. Mm -hmm. 
How much is that? I think that is a 385. Oh, okay. And the packaging is really pretty. Mm -hmm. And then this is the serum. That is the serum. It's very bougie. <laughs> I love that. That's like my favorite part about that serum. Yes. This is the packaging. Yes. <laughs> yeah, Pearl's bagel. It's pizza and bagels. But it's really, really good. Their pizza is fantastic. Are ready to film the experience of opening this $200 flipstick? Oh my gosh, how bougie is this? I love it. Look, Vald Armor. Was it Valde? Valde. Mm -hmm. Valde Armor. Ooh, that's a nice little statement right there. Thank you so much, Alicia. You are the most welcome. Valde. Valde. Okay, put my tissue up. I have some mirror on the end. Okay, let's see what it does. Here. Oh wow, you did such a good job, Alicia. <laughs> God. <laughs> oh wow, this is nice though. And then, yep, uh, refills will be coming in February, and refills are $40. Ooh. So. Okay guys, so I just got home, and my friend asked me if I wanted to go out with her for dinner, so I said yes, and so, in like two and a half, three hours, I'm gonna be going out for dinner. And I have this cute outfit on. You can kind of see it in the mirror behind me. Um, I'm gonna try to show you the outfit. Let's see. Let's see if I can show you. And then, yeah, let's just see. So, yeah, so this is what it looks like. I don't have any shapewear on. Like I said, if I had shapewear on, it would just make my waist like a little bit it would make my waist go in like that basically so i might wear shapewear tomorrow but i don't know if i will because i think this looks good like what do you guys think and then in the back there's like a slit so it's cute um so yeah i feel like i never show you guys my closet just because i don't know i always film in my bedroom but never in my closet Maybe I'll start filming in my closet soon. Who knows? Um, you hear that little one? That's this dog. And then the other dog right here. So now both of them want attention, don't you? You can't see both of them. So this is... <laughs> okay, okay. Anyways. So I'm thinking for this outfit because it's all black I'm thinking these shoes would look so so cute now I know these look like mock and mock shoes but they're not these are a dupe that I got for like $90 after watching Claire Chanel's YouTube channel so I bought these they're in a size 9 but I wear like a size like nine and a half ten and honestly they fit really really well so I like them and I feel like these are gonna look really cute today I had no plans to do anything today until I started vlogging and I feel like it made me more motivated like I feel like I got everything I needed to get done today except for grocery shopping because that wasn't like a priority but everything else that was like an actual priority was done and accomplished, which is like really nice. <laughs> Cause that doesn't always happen like that. So anyways, this is my outfit. 
and and I still need to do my hair and I need to uh, I still need to show you guys like a few things that I purchased like on my clothing rack but I'm gonna do that tomorrow because the sun's down now but yeah I will see you guys Thank you, that's good. Thank you. They ended up. <laughs> I love it. No, I love it. I'm enjoying it. I keep going. <sighs> so. I'm back in my room and we are going to film the haul part of this video. So I have purchased a few items lately. Not that many. Actually, I take that back. I have purchased a lot of things. I'm only going to show you a portion of what I've actually gotten. Um, and I guess we'll start off with an item that I thought I had lost. I took this item to my tailor to have like fixed because the shoulder had like a little rip on it and I left it at the tailor since August and I just got it back yesterday as you saw on the vlog so yeah so this Norma Kamali off the shoulder top that I wore last night to dinner this is off the shoulder bodysuit so looks like this and the thing about this bodysuit specifically is that it doesn't unbutton at the bottom so you have to put it on from like the top you have to step into it so yeah this is the first item but i'm just happy that i was able to get it back from my tailor because i would have been really sad if i would have forgotten about it anyways then I went to Zara when I was in Greece a few weeks ago. I was in Greece the last week of November. And I got a few things. The only issue with these pants, I actually tried these pants on um, in a previous video that I haven't uploaded yet. So I might take that clip and post it to this video. Maybe. We'll see. But basically... It's just these leggings, these leggings that have a pleat down the center. Then you get down to the bottom and it opens right around like the shin area of your leg. It's just very flattering. The only issue is I actually need to take these to the tailor and have them shortened because I'm five foot five inches and these are way too long for me. So yeah. I mean, once I take them to the tailor and get them fixed, they're going to fit perfectly. But the way you're going to see them in this video, not a vibe. Not a vibe at all. But once I get them tailored, I will be wearing these like every day. Next, these are another pair of pants that I got from Zara. These are just leather trousers. Um, they have pockets with the tissue in them um <laughs> they have pockets on the back they tie in the front they are not the most flattering pants i have but they are not uncomfortable they are super super comfy they go with a lot of things um i'm going to show you a couple of shirts um in the next couple of minutes and the shirts i show you go really really well with these pants but yeah, it's just faux leather pants. They look like this. They're very, very nice, I think. Then next, we have one of my favorite pieces. I love this shirt. I actually might put this on in a second because I love it so much. This is just like a silk black top from Zara. I'm thinking about getting it in pink and white. But it's just a flowy... Look how flowy that is. Flowy, silky, black top. I love wearing this to work. I always get so many compliments every time I wear this. It looks so luxurious, especially when I pair it with my 
Cartier watch and my like rings and I have my diamonds on and I just feel like I look so cute um, I feel like this with a nice pair of pants like with those black leggings from Zara and my Manolo Blahnix would be the cutest outfit but like I feel like this shirt would go really really well with a pair of Manolos <laughs> so when I show you in the cutaway I'm probably going to be wearing my black Manolos with it because it's just kind of the same texture like the shininess matches the shininess in the shirt matches the shininess in the in the satin shoe does that make sense anyways this shirt is so so comfy so I'm gonna put it on now so here's me with the shirt on oh, it feels so flowy and so nice let's move on to the other couple of items though so I can like get through this in a decent amount of time so next I have two gorgeous items from a brand called Marcella oh my gosh you guys I got these these are the only things I purchased on Black Friday because they are just so different so cute and I was like I need these I need these um oh my god I just love these so much so the first one and you're really going to have to see what this looks like on because you're not going to like get the full effect from me just showing you. But this is the first one right here. And it's just this like turtleneck that has that like cut out around like the um, collarbone area. So it's just a really pretty turtleneck with a cut out around that collarbone shoulder area. Really, really flattering fits nicely I got mine in a large I should have gotten it in a medium I really should have but large is fine because you know I can always put it in the dryer or get it tailored or whatever so I'm not mad at it I usually tuck it into a pair of pants so it doesn't matter but it's so so cute and so flattering so flattering you guys so so flattering and I love the attention to detail that this brand has I'll tell you more about it after I show you the next item. So, the next item is another turtleneck, but it looks like this. And you have to see, you see this? Lots of cutouts, right? There's cutout here, cutout here, but it's such a cute turtleneck. I needed basics, right? So, I really wanted to focus on basics. Basic, like, t-shirts like this one basic black turtlenecks but I like that it has cut out so it's something different it's not something super super basic even though I like basics you know sometimes we want something extra something that makes them like jazz them up a little bit um so I love this one again you have to see it on to get the full effect you really do so I'll show you guys what it looks like on in a minute but it's chef's kiss so good so worth the money this is what I love about this brand I'm about to show you it comes in this little bag right here right it says one design five school days yeah one design five school days then there was this it says thank you for helping us revolutionize the ethics of fashion everyone involved in the making of these designs enjoys a living wage free health care 40 hour work week, 20 days paid vacation annually, social security benefits, paid sick days, paid overtime. This is a fabulous brand, you guys. Comes with this pencil, and then, you know, this is wrapped around the pencil. Your voice is power for every story you create from the inside of your thoughts to the tip of this pencil. Know that you're helping a girl write her own design that matters. This brand, I will be purchasing from them forever. This is, this is what quality is. The pricing is affordable. Well, like, the pricing is, like, worth it. It's not the most cheap item in the world, but it's good quality. And they care about their workers and they help people and honestly like everything about this brand is a vibe 
hands down. If you buy anything from this haul, you should purchase from Marcella. Hands down. And this is not sponsored, by the way. I spent my own money on these things. But I just, I'm so impressed by this brand. It's not even funny. So next, this is another item that I purchased when I was in Athens. I think... Like I said, I think I tried it on in a previous video. I haven't uploaded yet, but I'll try it on for you in this video. This is from a brand called Cos, C-O-S. Really, really nice. It's a neoprene. Really, really cute pencil skirt. Sucks you in. I got a size European small because I wanted it to like really do some like cinching up my waist this is a fabulous skirt feels so nice i honestly probably going to wear this skirt with one of those turtlenecks i just showed you such a cute outfit like i just can't say enough good things about all the items i've been buying lately this i know is going to hold up for so many years absolutely worth the money I made a little purchase from Moda Operandi, which is my favorite store. I always, I love the name because it's named after Moda Operandi, which is like, you know, your like go-to thing, like basically. So Moda Operandi is like your go-to is basically what it means, like your go-to place. I, I don't know. Does that make sense how I'm describing it? If you know, you know. I'll put the definition of Moda Operandi like right here. But Moda Operandi is one of my favorite stores. I bought this turtleneck. And I like this because this is actually a postcard as the tag. Isn't that cute? Isn't that cute? I, I like it. So this brand is called Matek. Matek? Matek? And there's like a seam down the back. But this is just a nice turtleneck. That's all this is. is like a really nice, basic, thick turtleneck like this is a really nice layering piece so like when it's really cold outside when it's snowing or whatever I can see myself wearing this with like you know my ski outfit on and my like I don't know my like is it called a visor you know what I'm talking about like I can see me layering this in many different scenarios so I honestly because it's so thick probably won't show you what it looks like on it's just a basic turtleneck it's super super thick and it was on sale and it probably is still on sale so if it is i'll link it below if not it's just a basic turtleneck so it's not it's not that big of a deal okay but it's nice another thing i purchased from zara um where was i in greece in athens was just this white button-up shirt I have like a get ready with me video that I filmed there. I'm just kind of contemplating whether I want to upload it because my skin was like breaking out and looked really bad. But <laughs> this is just a plain white button up shirt and it's super comfy and I don't know. When I wear this shirt, I wear it with um, a cardigan over my shoulders. And like a pair of like black trousers and it just looks nice you go. And then I was walking around Zara and I saw this now this is the chocolate brown this is the pants they're just like you know nice satin pants and then this is the top super wrinkly because I am in dire need of a steamer that's what I should have asked for for Christmas but whatever it's too late now um yeah so it kind of like has these like pleats on the side to give you like a little bit more of a waist I think I got this top in the top is in an extra large the pants are in a large and I should have got the pants in a medium but I didn't think about it and then last but not least this is such a gorgeous piece of clothing that I'm about to show you I bought this on Moda Operandi 
but this is a dress from St. Agni. And me showing you on the hanger will not do it justice, but I'm still going to do it, but I'm going to have to sh try it on so you guys can see. Because on the hanger, you're going to be like, what? That doesn't look like anything. It has like a low arm slit. So it kind of is going to, I feel like that makes your chest look really nice. I don't know. It's really, really, really cute. And it has a slit in the back too. So I might wear that dress tonight. I haven't decided just yet, but I might at all. Anyways, that's it, guys. Um, in the meantime, I hope you guys liked this vlog. I'm going to kind of sign off here, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Happy holidays, and I'll see you next week.